Hi, my name is Dave Bauer, and I'm a retired police officer from the city of St. Charles. I worked at the city of St. Charles from 1978 until 2012 when I retired. During my career, I was a patrolman, uh, the first part, mainly worked nights. I was on the SWAT team uh, for 12 years. Uh, and then in 1988, when the department started the mounted unit, I was selected for that. And I spent 23 years on horseback. I think I knew I wanted to be a policeman when I was 16 or 17 years old. I would have to say the two men that influenced me to be a police officer was uh, a third cousin named Richard Hankey, who was a deputy with the St. Charles County Sheriff's Department and a trooper, Frank Berg, who patrolled this area uh, when I was in high school. They inspired me to want to be like them. During my career, I, I, I started out as a patrolman in a car. I, uh, I did write the first FTO program, field training officer program for the department. Uh, I d was a field training officer. Uh, in 1980, the department started a SWAT team and I was selected to that spent 12 years on the SWAT team uh, in 1988. Uh, when they started the mounted unit, I was selected for that. Uh, and I finished out my career on horseback. The responsibilities were we took care of the horses. We did all the barn maintenance. That was all incorporated into our workday. Uh, an hour before and an hour after patrol shift was dedicated to the animals. Once a year we had a week of training for the horses. See all the other horses running? And our main patrol areas is the bars on Main Street where we work six to two, six in the evening to two in the morning. But we also did the special events, festivals, parades, uh, any problem areas, uh, work shopping centers during Christmas shopping time, things of that nature. Maggie, who my wife bought me for my 10th wedding, and our 10th wedding anniversary, uh, it's like I tell people, I bought her a ring, she bought me a horse, I got the better deal. I used Maggie for 19 years. Uh, a lot of hours with her. I spent anywhere from 40 to 60 hours a week with that horse for 19 years. Uh, she was my partner. Good police horse. She passed away August 20th of 2011. And then I had another young Morgan horse, Bo, that I put out on the street at four. I trained him since he was two and I used him for four years and I still own him and ride him as my personal horse. Uh, he went with me in retirement since I owned him. One of the funny things that I remember happening on Main Street is one of the big issues people always had was when the horses took a poop. Uh, they just thought that was just terrible. One night when the bars were closing, Bo took a dump. The drunks started coming out of some of the bars and they thought that was just hilarious so they started sticking $20 bills in it and you know, daring other people to pick him out. And finally some girl come out and she goes, I was raised in the country, I don't care. And she grabbed the money up and she wanted to split it with me, but I was working, I couldn't do it. So she made off with 120 bucks. The nice thing about working on Main Street is you met a lot of good people, uh, people that you, st it, it's kind of like I always tell people, it's like being in the army. You might not see each other for a while, but when you do, you have that common bond and you talk to each other, the guys on the department, the people that are always on Main Street. It, it was just an enjoyable experience. I had, and I was very fortunate. I rode my horse for a living and I worked in a, a, a really good place.